Morning, I'm Michael from Moat Monster Gaming, and if you enjoy the video, please like and subscribe. So today I'm opening two G.I. Joe classified figures. And the first one here is Zorana, who's one of the dreadlocks, and this is Baroness, and both of them are Cobra. So I'm gonna do Zorana first, because I don't have an original Zorana, and I'm quite excited to see what she looks like. So just a quick look on the back, kind of got like an action posy picture, and then we've got a little bit of comic -y picture on the side, got a face down here, and then here they are in their packaging. So, open them up. And what I like about the Joes is they come with so many accessories. So there they are. So looking at her here, I really, really like this pink outfit that she has here. And I like this random strap, so it's like asymmetrical. Um, we have got double jointed elbows with a little pad on the back, which is excellent. And we have rotation underneath the shoulder pad bit. So actually that's very, very cool. So looking at the legs, we've got kind of ripped jeans showing tights. We've got these spurs at the end, so that's quite cool. Feet move very nicely. And here we have a scabbard, and that's gonna be for the knife. But I do like this kind of ball joint that we have in here, allowing loads of moving backwards and forwards. So as with all Joe figures, they're absolutely great. And this one is no exception. She looks excellent. Now, it does come with lots of accessories. So if I just grab them out. So first of all, we have this this knife here, which is kind of cool. So it's too big to go in here. So that's because I think this little tiny one, like a stiletto, goes in like so. I will say I'm a little disappointed that we can see such a big gap for the legs, at the top of the legs there, but it's still a great figure. now. We have backpack here, and as always, I do love how the Joe's backpacks all fit weapons inside them. So I'm guessing that this goes in like that, like so. Or, yeah, so I'm guessing that one goes in like that. Let's put that there. And then here we have another gun, and this one's kind of got like a chainsaw piece at the end. Now it comes with this kind of magazine bit. I'm assuming, can't quite work out where that's supposed to go. Oh, I see. Okay, so that's very cool. So that goes in like so. So that's that's quite cool. I like the fact that you can then take that out and replace it. So that's quite good. So let's put that in hand. Now, the other thing that I really like about this figure is it comes with an alternate haircut. Now, this hairstyle is what she had in the original cartoon, whereas this is kind of like a more modern look. So I'm hoping this is gonna be easy to whip off and change. Okay, so it just literally falls off. So let's put that. So, that's kind of a very classic 80s hairdo. I'm not sure which one of the two that I prefer, but I do quite, I think she looks very, very much more like a dreadnought with that hair. So let's just put her to one side. Now this is Baroness. Now I've always liked Baroness. This is my original early 80s one. I also have the one that comes with Megatron, the transforming his tank one. But this is my original, we say 84 Hasbro one, sw swivel arm version. Now I like this haircut that Baroness has, the classic look. I'm not sure about Baroness's sort of short bob that she has here, but I'm sure that the attachments are gonna make up for it. Let's put her there. Now this is from the Snake Eyes film 
And then if we just flip it over, there we go. There's a picture of snake eyes on the back, but. Okay, so there they are. Still, still prefer the original haircut, quite like the choker round the neck though, like the big cobra on the belt. So we've got two little holstery bits for like sort of like scimitar knives and no backpack unfortunately, which I think is a shame. Um, not sure about the face, I think I'm going to, need to put glasses straight on here. So teeny tiny glasses. So glasses on, and I think I still prefer the look from the original one. But that doesn't necessarily make this a bad figure because we have got plenty of articulation. Unlike Zorana though, we only have single hinge elbows, not double jointed, and we don't have as much rotation in the hands. Now this is number 19. So this is actually one of the first, one of the earlier ones they brought out, still has the nice shoulder socket still like the rubberized parts to the belt boots are good feet move nicely but you can definitely see the improvement with the later figures they brought out i mean zorana's actually figure i'm gonna say 40 she's figure 48 i mean we're now into the hundreds with some of them and they come with so many accessories they're just absolutely fabulous but going through baroness's accessories so we have these two knives, which are okay. They just go in the holsters at the back. They actually go quite far in, actually, almost push them all the way through. But still, they go in nicely. Um, but what I quite like is this gun. You can attach silencer to it. So I think that's a nice touch. That's Put this in her hand. So there we go, Baroness. Baroness and Zorana. Thank you very much for looking. Take care. <laughs>